So it, it sounds like this Buddhism and the connecting experiences is your focus in your life nowadays, is it? Yes, yes. I, I, I've been um, especially focused on a, a Tantra, a Buddhist practice in a Nepal. Uh, sorry. Yes. Uh, and, um, uh, and Bhutan. And the, the wonderful um, wall hanging is a hand-woven carpet from Bhutan. And Bhutan is a country that's uh, steeped. Uh, it, it's Buddhism is is the national uh, religion. In fact, the only uh, religion. Um, and and um, I've been uh, deeply impressed by how Bhutan is a country and their whole process of gross national happiness, mm -hmm. uh, which is which is really all based uh, on Buddhism. That the the focus on uh, on joy and living uh, a compassionate and joyful life. And, and I've been kind of weaving that um, into Gestalt uh, because Gestalt has very much the notion of accepting who you are, awareness of who you are. Buddhism has an, another perspective of, of um, striving, striving actually, a, a kind of strange effort of, um, of, of focusing on letting go. Uh, whereas my experience of Gestalt is simply being and expressing who you are. Um, their focus is on, on letting go of a uh, certain emotion. So it, it's kind of working with, with two different um, realities and, and weaving them together. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the, the uh, particular practices that I was uh, noticed, which is considered to be an advanced practice, is uh, using what we would call the empty chair. So um, if you have a difficult uh, relationship, if you're struggling to understand someone and you're having an internal reaction to them, they, they, there is a practice where you, uh, in effect, put yourself in their shoes. Mm -hmm. You uh, allow yourself to experience their world. And as we know in Gestalt, the two chair exercise creates then understanding and compassion, which is really the, the emphasis in Buddhism. How do we find compassion and understanding? Um, so it was, it was lovely to, to come across um, that uh, technique, mm -hmm. uh, which kind of favored very much uh, our Gestalt methodology. So, th so the two um, I'm finding very complementary, and, um, but, you know, still very challenging. The next step in, in my life. <laughs>